we talk a lot in our field about your first allegiance is to the people you support. So the first allegiance are, are to the, the individuals with disabilities that, that you're working with. However, in, in real life, you know, your first allegiance is to your family. Your first allegiance is to your loved ones. And, and generally those can be like, like, you know, separate things. And what's happened in the pandemic is you could be stationed at a, at a group home and someone could be COVID positive. And as a DSP, you're concerned about bringing that home to your family. And, and all of a sudden, those two allegiances are like combating each other for the first time. And that's not an easy thing to process. Like what, what do you put in front? Is it, is it serving the people with disabilities? Is it getting a paycheck? Or is it being in your house and being safe with your family? And that's a really difficult thing for DSPs to, to, to navigate. And I, and I don't, I have, whatever anyone has decided, whether you're a DSP and, and have made that decision that I, I can't work right now, I can't take the, the uh, risk, or if you're a DSP that's jumped in and you're on the front lines and you're doing it, um, I, I don't judge anybody because this is something unheard of. I just hope moving forward, or, you know, when this is all done, I mean, if God, and I hope this is over. I hope this is like an aberration and we never see anything like this again. But if the fall rolls around and there's a spike in COVID-19 again, and we start hearing those words like social distancing and, and lockdowns and things like that being thrown around again, if our field reacts the exact same way they reacted now, then I'm, I'm going to be quite disappointed because we need to learn from this, if nothing else.